Hi, my name is Sharon, and today I'm going to show you how to use PickKit 3's new Programmer to Go function. The Programmer to Go function allows you to quickly and easily reprogram any PIC microcontroller device. This includes PIC 16, PIC 18, PIC 24, DS PIC 33, and PIC 32 devices. This is a particularly handy feature for the field that does not require any extra hardware and can program up to a full 512K byte flash with the push of a button. Before using the Programmer to Go function, test your hex file and make sure devices are programming as expected. Then you will need to set up the function on the Picket 3 using MPLAB IDE. In MPLAB IDE, Go to the PitKit 3 settings and select the Programmer to Go tab. Once you have the appropriate settings, hit the Send Image in Memory button. When it is finished, you will see the output window. From now on, when the PitKit 3 is connected to a power source, the active LED will blink to indicate the Programmer to Go is indeed ready to program. Using the PitKit 3, we can reprogram this hardware with the hex file we just copied. Connect the PitKit 3 to a power source and ensure the power LED is lit. The active LED will also blink once to indicate it is ready to program. Now connect the PitKit 3 to the target. Ensure that the target is properly powered either by PitKit 3 itself or an external power supply. Now all you have to do is push the PitKit 3 button. The status LED will turn orange while it reprograms the device. Wait for the status LED to turn green. This indicates the PitKit 3 has now finished reprogramming the hardware. The Programmer to Go function is now available in the latest version of MPLAB IDE. It is downloadable at microchip.com slash MPLAB. To learn more about PitKit 3, visit microchip.com slash pitkit3.